Morning, everyone. I guess first on the list, I'd like to thank, let's see, it was at Stephen Thompson Thundersticks. I uh, appreciate uh, the super thanks. Every bit helps, and uh, thank you. All right, next on the agenda is here. We're going to test out the Husqvarna X-Cut. So a while back, I had seen it. I haven't purchased no chains in like two years. I think I did one from the saw ship down the road, but I didn't notice this if it was around longer than... Anyways, I started looking for a chain, and I seen one other day, this X-Cut, and uh, thought I'd give it a, a try. It says it stays sharp longer, I believe was one of the... Yeah, long-lasting sharpness, increased cutting efficiency, low stretch. I think that's it, yeah, in a different language. So, yeah, we're going to test it out. I did use it a little bit on that log yesterday, and from what I used of it, liked it. So, not sponsored by these guys, but if Husqvarna, if you're watching... You could sponsor me if you'd like. <laughs> All right, everyone, let's get into the video. All right, here we go. I busted out my old chaps for you guys. I washed them and everything. These have been through a lot. I've, uh... All the different guys I've hired over the years have wore these, and my cousin's worn them the last couple of years when I'd have them here cutting. But. pretty good I mean I haven't used the new regular chain in a while but I seem to usually feel like I sharpen pretty good but uh all right I'll uh 
do a little time lapse. This is a big pile, so I'll probably do it. Instead of doing it the medium speed, I'll go that hyper speed. So it actually looks like I'm getting something done. If I uh, went at that medium speed that my app adds, uh, or my app gives me, fuck, we'd be here all day. I forgot to turn the camera back on, but see, that's how I like to do it. I just sit there and cut long strips with it all piled up. Usually works pretty good, as long as, you know, start at one end and just work your way down. The very end there is where it's the worst. But if you got them good and stacked up one way, so I'll cut it for a minute like this to show you. Maybe I'll just, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll not even put the hyperlapse on and just tell you when I'm done. The axe cut. So I've hit a lot of these logs, got dirt on them. That one right there, it's just caked in. So, and... It seems to be cutting still quite well. I'm sure a regular chain I would have uh, already been wanting to sharpen by now. Almost positive. I've been cutting this slab wood up and dirty firewood for quite a while to realize that does hold a lot better edge. That's what it says. It's That's the feature that caught my eye was that it would stay sharp longer, so... All right, everyone, thanks for watching. Sorry, this ain't much. Uh, no sawmilling, but uh, I guess we're cutting up sawmill slabs, if that counts. All right, everyone, have a good one. Thanks.